Hi everyone, this is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to the channel. In this video, we are going to have a look at a new project which solves a real world problem. It enables you to de-reflect or remove a reflection from any image. Let me show you a working demo. So if you look at this example from their project page, which I will drop the link in video's description. So I'm just using my mouse to use it on this first image or from the left at the top row you see so i'm deflecting it so this is the original image and once you pass it through this new model it simply removes the reflection look at this one so this is original and this plane is now much more crystal clear again look at this one on the third image and this is what this new model does it simply re removes the reflection from these images and they have a lot of other examples from their project page now reflection removal of a single image really remains a highly challenging task due to the complex entanglement between target scenes and unwanted reflections but this framework tries to resolve it and despite significant progress most of the existing methods are hindered by the scarcity of high quality diverse data and insufficient restoration priors. And that is where this project tries to help out. Not only that, they also have introduced a data set which is named as Diverse Reflection Removal or DRR that has been created by randomly rotating reflective mediums in target scenes that enables a variation of reflection angles and intensities. We are going to install this model locally, D-Reflection Any Image or DAI, and then we will see how it works. They also have a very nicely written repo, which you can follow through if you are also looking to install it locally, and that is what I'm going to do in this video. Let me also give a huge shout out to Mast Compute who are sponsoring this VM Ubuntu and this GPU card NVIDIA RTX 6000 with 48 GPU of VRAM. Let me create by creating a virtual environment and if you're also looking to rent a GPU on very affordable prices, you can find the link to their website in video's description. Plus, I'm also going to give you a discount coupon code of 50% for a range of GPUs, so do check them out. So let's wait for this environment to get created. And now let's git clone the repo of this dereflection any image. And then we are going to install all the prerequisites from the root of the repo with the help of pip here. This is going to take few minutes. So while that happens, let me also introduce you to the sponsors of the video who are Camel AI. Camel is an open source community focused on building multi-agent infrastructures for finding the scaling laws of agents with applications in data generation, task automation, and world simulation. Everything is installed. Let's now run our gridio demo from the root of the repo. All you need to do is to just run this command, python demo.py. And the first time when you run it, it is going to download the model for you and the size is just 1.46 gig and it is going to download some other metadata too so let's wait for it to get downloaded and there you go everything is installed and the demo is running on our local host so let me open this and there you go it is running on our local host so we can simply select an image with the reflection on the left hand side and then click on dereflection. So let me first pick up one of the examples. So I just picked up this. Let me click on dereflection and it is going to dereflect it on the right hand side. And there you go. This is how it looks like and you can already see the difference. The processed image with this DAI is really crystal clear. Let's try out one more example. I'm just going to go with maybe this one. Let's go up so there is clear reflection there. I'm just going to click on remove reflection. There you go, you see the difference, how good that looks. Let's also check the VRAM consumption. So it is just touch over 11 gig of VRAM, which I think for the quality which it is producing, not bad at all. 
Okay, so this is good. Now let me try out our local image. So I'm just going to pick up one image from my um, local directory. So I'm just going to go with maybe this or this we already have tested. I just wanted to let's try this one out. So this is a reflection which looks good, but let's see if it can remove this reflection from the water. Should be fun to see. No, so it just uh, de-reflects the malfunction. So this is good. And it has actually enhanced the image if you closely look. Looks really good. Okay, let's try out another one. So this is what we are talking about. This is the uh, reflection. So let's check it out. And wow, look at this. This is simply magic pretty good you can see that it has really not only removed the reflection but also increased and enhanced the quality of the image okay let's try one more so maybe we will try this one again this is a good reflection so hopefully it won't remove that there you go so it, it has enhanced it and looks perfectly well and if you closely look it hasn't really changed the image which is good Okay, let's try out one more. There you go. So there is some reflection as you can see on this side. Let's check it out. There you go. You see, again, very subtle, you know, enhancement, but looks really good. And if you look at the peak, you see there, there is a reflection, which it has the glare or reflection, whatever you could call it. Or maybe we could try out with a couple of glare images. So let me see if I have one. So let's check this one maybe. Okay, let's check with this one with the glare. <laughs> so this is a surface with a glare. So let's see if it can remove this glare. Yep, it has tried its best and looks pretty decent. Let's try out one more with the glare. So primarily it is reflection, but I think it also can do a bit of a good work with clearing there you go much much vivid than the other one looks pretty decent to me i think we have tested all of them i believe i have let's try out this one i think we all uh, yeah so this is the one from their project page yep looks pretty good so look i'm very impressed by this model let me know what do you think about it. I will drop the link to it in video's description. If you like the content, please consider subscribing to the channel. If you're already subscribed, please share it among your network as it helps a lot. Thank you for watching.